Tucked away in the northeast outskirts of Bellingham is Squalicum Lake, a fly fisher's hidden gem. Only six and a half miles out from Bellingham, this 30-acre spot lies just off Mount Baker Highway, surrounded by fields and distant hills. There's a very open feel to this location, especially on a clear day. To newcomers, this place may seem inaccessible at first, since a quick look up for directions will only guide you to Squalicum Lake Road. There, you'll drive by and see the lake, but it becomes clear any public routes actually leading to the water are absent. But to anyone just wanting to spend a good afternoon fly fishing, we have you covered. The key is to head east on Mount Baker Highway until you come across Y Road. Just before you would turn onto it, pull into the small lot on the right and park your car there. You'll see a couple small signs indicating you're on the right track. From there, grab your equipment, walk left around the signs, and continue along the straight trail. After a few minutes of walking, you will finally be greeted by the water. The public access point is small, consisting mainly of boat storage as well as a kiosk for fishing information. As you'll see, there are really no docks or shoreline to fish from, so bringing your own watercraft or fishing waders is highly recommended. It's worth noting as well that the lake is fly fishing only, and motorboats are not allowed, so if that's your style, this may be the perfect spot for you. We stopped by Confluence Fly Shop, and they were kind enough to give us some more information on the fish and flies to use at the lake. Uh, historically, Squalicum Lake had kind of a naturally reproducing population of coastal cutthroat trout. Now it it's still has those cutthroats. It's also stocked annually with uh, triploid rainbow trout that can get up to about 20 inches, seldom bigger than that. It's relatively shallow, it warms up early in the year. Uh, it's got an average depth of about 10 feet. So it's a good early season lake in March. Uh, fishing usually slows down in the heat of summer, but it'll fish well through June and then again into the fall. A variety of flies work there. In the spring, we fish a lot of coronamids, um, damselfly nymph imitations. Uh, in the evenings, you can fish dry flies to imitate the midges and some of the caddis flies that come off on the lake. Um, so really, really fun place to fish. A big thanks to Confluence Fly Shop for letting us stop by. The Fishing Club, Fourth Corner Fly Fishers, manages the launch area and asks that you fill out a slip reporting your catch. These papers can be found inside the kiosk. They also ask that you only keep two of your catches per day. Rumor has it that the shallow lake can freeze over enough during the winter for ice skaters to get a few days of play as well. Small lakes like these, run and populated by devoted locals, are part of what gives Whatcom County its unique feel. If you have a boat and haven't tried Squalicum Lake yet, it's worth a visit.